The history of esports, I would say, comes back from the early days when they first released Pong. And it stemmed from that and it stems further into the arcade games and having the scores on the chart, having your name in fame, your three characters, your initials. And it's gone from there to the multi-billion dollar industries it is now. So to take a look at an esports event, I would look at it from an entertainment perspective. Like a football match, it's unscripted, it's based on knowledge of the game and the shoutcasters should know what's going on and be able to call out the shots, out the game of how it's progressing, how it's playing. So eSports is a very exciting sport, because it is a sport at the end of the day. A lot of people will say it's not, but it is a sport. You'll be able to learn how to develop all those skills to run a successful uh, tournament or eSports event. You can learn how to build events, how to make sure that the players have the best experience that they can. And the audience as well, they will need to make sure that you have the, the right format, how they're going to watch it, what do you offer there, how you set it up. You'll need to have some merch stalls so you can you know, also upsell the team and make sure that they are aware of what, what's happening there. So what separates us from a general events course is going to be the equipment. So we're looking at, we have access to the full TV studio with 4K cameras. So from the management perspective, you actually have physical practicality of managing professional services rather than theoretically managing professional services. It's a degree that's going to be fun, it's going to be enjoyable but you're going to get some core skills that you can use throughout the world. If you were a production manager, you could be hosting any events. You could be looking at hosting a fashion show. You could be hosting a carnival. All the skills are there to run an event or to everything's there. It's all primarily the same, but we're doing it with something that is enjoyable and fun. It's really good to see that the university is investing into that and they can see that there is a potential. So through that course, you'll be able to build that skill of how you're going to be able to manage the team, the events, create relationships with partners, build sponsorships, you know. Because when you have an esports event, it's all about how you're going to build it and sponsorships. You want companies to come at your event, give out freebies and make sure that the audience and the team is happy.